A noticeable difference between carnivores and herbivores is their eyes. A carnivore has forward-placed eyes to focus on prey, but a herbivore's eyes sit on the sides of the head to detect danger. Where an animal's eyes are placed in its head determines how it perceives the world around it. Eyes that face forward, as with leopards, create depth of vision. To determine distance is imperative for hunting or climbing trees. If your life depends on your ability to detect danger from any direction, then it's more critical to be aware of your surroundings rather than focusing on just one spot. The teeth of herbivores and carnivores also differ dramatically. While dogs tear apart their prey and swallow chunks of meat whole, their teeth are long and sharp, able to penetrate flesh and tear off pieces. Hyenas have powerful jaws actuated by strong muscles. Their bite is strong enough to crush even large bones into splinters. Herbivores have no use for teeth that can bite hard. Their challenge is to make vegetation digestible to extract nutrients. For this, they have large flat teeth with hard ridges for chewing their food and breaking down plant cell walls. A giraffe's jaw chews sideways to refine the plant material and start digesting the cells. Eyes, feet and teeth. Every body part is designed to cater to the animal's needs. Even small details like nails differ between the species. A rhino's large flat nails help plant its feet firmly on the ground. An antelope's hooves are modified nails to make it flight or foot. Nails can also be weapons, like the sharp curved claws of predators, used in self-defense or to attack. When they are not needed, the dangerous claws can be safely withdrawn into sheaths. Notwithstanding all these external differences, predator and prey are both perfectly adapted for their lifestyles in nature. <laughs>